YouTube, it's your girl Rachel Rose here back with another video and today I'm going to be doing a mukbang or mukbang, whatever you prefer. Point is, I'm going to be eating and today I have seafood, so I got, I got shrimp, corn, sausage, potatoes, and I got a king crab right here. So, it's hot. Now, I be seeing videos of people doing this, but... Uh, they usually have scissors. See, I don't got no scissors, so I'm gonna try to do this southern style without no scissors using my teeth, but I don't know how that's gonna work because they got spikes on them and that's gonna hurt. But um, before I start, let me just say my grace real quick. So, one second. All right, so let me go ahead and get my thumbnail in. You know what I'm saying? I gotta get my thumbnail like. All right, so I got my bowl here for all the shells and everything, but I'm gonna just be talking to y'all. I don't know if I'm gonna finish this whole plate because I'm not too, too hungry, but um, where I got this seafood from was this restaurant called The Drunken Crab. I don't know if they're located across country, but um, I know for a fact that they're located in Santa Barbara and they're located in LA. So, if you want some seafood, this is where you get it. I believe, I believe they said it's supposed to be Louisiana style seafood. Then it is. I mean, I think so. This is only my second time eating food from them. Last time I got crawfish and shrimp. This is gonna be so messy. I tried to do this before. It gets really dark. Because I'm using natural lighting. So. Yeah, I love seafood so much. A little background. Um, growing up, me and my sister never really was able to eat seafood growing up because both of our parents are allergic. So they're allergic to uh, shellfish. So we never really had seafood. So whenever we did get it, we were like really excited and stuff like that. And really happy to get it. So now, it's like, <clears throat> hold on. Now that I'm at the house, when I get the chance to get some, I go ahead and get it. What I really need to start doing is uh, trying to go fishing like crabbing and crawfishing. I don't know if they have, I don't know how the environment is around here though. But uh, I wanna go about get my own seafood. Go and catch it myself. We have a lot of money. Oh boy. I wonder if I got some scissors. Oh. Man, damn. I didn't think about this. I think they accidentally gave me spicy uh, seasoning on this. On the crab. It was either crab or shrimp. Direct receipt. I didn't want spicy, I wanted medium. I don't really like spicy stuff like that. Bite this junk. 
I just don't like spicy stuff like that because I, I think, I feel like whenever I have something really spicy, I'm not tasting the food anymore. I'm just tasting nothing but heat. And I don't like that. My sister loves spicy stuff. I actually got this food yesterday. It is kind of hot. Ugh. Got my water bottle right here for me. I see that meat right there. Why y'all here? Whew. It's getting hot. Um, while y'all here, make sure y'all hit the like button and subscribe and turn on my post notifications so you can get more, more alerts whenever I post more videos. This is my first official mukbang and I hope it turns out good. So uh, I do hope it turns out good because it's going to suck if it doesn't. Either way, I'm going to post it anyway. Um... And if you have any extra time on your hands, if you only, only if you have extra time, could you post in the comment section some video ideas or things that you would like me to do or talk about or try out? I'd appreciate that. So hard getting this with the gloves on. <sighs> Taste that heat, man. I love potatoes. Mm. Whoa. <laughs> I got the moves. Whoa. Just put the shells in the plate at this point. I don't even know I need this shrimp like this. The darn shell sticking to the shrimp. See that? All that good seasoning. Mm. <clears throat> I ain't had no seafood in so long, man. Don't make no sense. You know what I do want, dog? I want some, um, I want a Japanese meat bun. 
Y'all heard of that before? Japanese meat buns? I don't know exactly what they call, called, but they got meat in them. And they buns. Self-explanatory, I guess. It sucks when your face eats you. So, right now, I am in the middle of preparing to um, move right now. So, I'm actually moving into a new place on Wednesday in two days. So... I really just got here. I only been here for like a month. A month and two weeks, I think. Almost two weeks. But I'm moving because I'm getting roommates. And I'll save a lot of money in getting roommates. I really want to turn them crabs. Some big old. <clears throat> Whew. Hit the throat. Um. Yeah, these crab is big. I'm gonna go look for some scissors in a second. find some scissors. I'll be right back. Man, this is all I can find. These little kid safety scissors, man. I'm gonna wash them. Let me see how these work. Where that leg I was already working on. <clears throat> Now, buddy, hold on. See, I ain't used to cutting crab. I used to use my teeth. But then again, I never eat king crab. I don't know. I don't know when the last time I had king crab. Ah, there we go. Yeah, boy. All right, cut this joker in half. I'm gonna have to clean up after this when you see food all over the place. Come on. Oh, yeah, 
There it go. It's falling out though. Get on out of there. Damn, I can't get to it. I'm scared I'm going to cut my mouth. I'm really struggling, bro. Should have did some research before I did this. I hope y'all understand, like, it's my first video. It's a little choppy. Bust it wide open, bust it wide open, bust it wide open. Oh, jump. Oh, oh, oh. Put it in some of that saucy sauce. Boy. That's good wholesome crab. Nose running. Woo wee. I'm gonna get full off of water before I finish this. Go ahead and cut this. You know what I'm saying? Cut that. Gonna be a pro out here. Huh. What? Go ahead and get that meat right there. This one just fell out. Mm. I don't got my groove back. Okay, I don't need this no more. I'm gonna shoot this. So I can split it, split it open. See, I don't cut it up, but it's all right. Yup. That's it. That's it right there. Y'all wonder how much I pay for this? Seventy dollars. 
Yep. I know it's gonna be seventy dollars. Like I said, <clears throat> the first time I went there, we only got crawfish. And like potatoes and, and corn and stuff. So, my friend happened to be in LA and I asked her if she could uh, stop by the Drunken Crab to uh, pick me up some seafood. And I told her what I wanted. And then she sent me the receipt because she had already ordered it. So I didn't know how much it was until after she ordered it. And then, yeah, so I had to suck it up, though, because, I mean, nothing else I could have did. I wasn't finna make her pay for it. So, um, yeah, this food cost $70. I have my Air Force shirt. <clears throat> I think I dripped some on the floor. I <sighs> Tom Brown. How people do this? I'm not on fire. It's good though. Yeah, I don't mind that. I'm I live on base, so at five o'clock they always. I'm sorry. At five o'clock they always play that. That reminds me. I need to make a video for you guys that answers any questions you have about the Air Force. Or maybe a couple of videos, um, I'm sorry, a couple of questions you may have about the military in general. Actually, while I was in tech school, I recorded a video that explained how um, boot camp was, but um, it was pretty lengthy. It was like 26 minutes, but I tried to go into detailing and tell you how, <clears throat> tell you guys like how it was, especially from a female perspective, but like I had, I mean, there was a lot of things that the guys did with us. What the guys had to do too, so. Do I have any questions about that? Let me know in the comment section. And I'll try to answer them for you. I think I'm going to post that video. I don't know if I want to make a new one or just post that one. What y'all think? None of my sausages. I'm getting full, y'all. Should 
thing is this water, bro. I really been slacking on videos, so I just got back into um, recording videos. Cause before my last video, it was like four weeks that had gone by since the one before that one. But I told y'all in my first video on my channel, I said that I'm gonna try to dedicate myself to YouTube, and I'm gonna be consistent with it. And that is what I'm trying to do. <sighs> Y'all. Yeah. Okay. One thing I must say, though. I don't know if it's because of me or what. But I said that this shrimp was sticking to the shell. It's one thing to be doing that, but this shit getting mushy. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. What does it mean when it, the shrimp get mushy? Is it old? Should not should I have not recooked it or something? I'm going to have to record a part two to this one because I cannot finish all this. I don't know how, but I don't got soiled through the gloves, so I don't know what I'm wearing anymore. But my hands, I feel it in my fingers. All in my fingers, bro. All on my fingers, not in my fingers. Whew. Well, I did something. Hey. Yeah. I put a little dent in it, you know what I mean? Oh, shoot. I'm going to drop it. It's one plate. It's the other plate. I did a little something, you know what I mean? But that's all I'm gonna be eating today, y'all, because I cannot. <laughs> I feel like I need to brush my teeth and everything. I feel like I smell like straight seafood. So um, yeah, so this basically sums up the video, y'all. This is actually the longest video I ever recorded. Um, it's coming up on 30 minutes or nearly 30 minutes. Um Y'all make sure y'all like, subscribe, and turn on my post notifications because I will be posting some more videos. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. And if you made it this far, you are loyal and I appreciate you. Um, do me a favor. Make sure you share this video with all your friends and all your social media if you can because I love you guys so much. So this is it. We'll see you in the next video and thanks for watching.